What's up everybody, Chris here from Bold Canyon Outdoors and today I want to talk to you about Condition 1 cases. I've been getting a lot of questions and comments about the cases that we have on top of the Jeep, our adventure cases. And we have two big yellow trunks up there and we have a long 55 inch rifle case which is a long flat case and they're all condition one cases. We also have condition one cases for our magnet fishing gear, our first aid kit. Alana's got all of her photography equipment in it with a big case with dividers for her camera equipment. It's really cool. The kids even have one from their Nintendo Switch setup with a custom foam insert that you can get from condition one cases. The reason why we go with them is, is several reasons. Number one, they've got a great warranty. They are warrantied for the life of the case by the original owner. It is water resistant to three feet underwater for 30 minutes. So you can put this thing underwater for a half an hour. It's covered by a warranty. The warranty is not going to cover the foam or any of the contents in the case, but they're going to cover the case. It is designed to be waterproof and dust proof. It's got a great O-ring gasket. Here, let me show you inside. Now this particular one is a small one. It's a 10 inch case. It's a single pistol case, number 312 on their website. But here, let's take a look inside. Their latches, let's start there. These latches are so easy to use. I've seen so many cases where you've got to kind of, you know, twist and pinch and push buttons and things like that. And they're just hard to use, but these are super easy. You grab it, you flip it. It's that easy to close it, push it back down. I mean, it doesn't get any easier than that. You're probably wondering what this is. This is actually a valve. This is a pressure valve. So if it's in a hot car or underwater or somewhere where it can increase or decrease the pressure within the case, this valve will actually help adjust the pressure a little bit. It's not gonna let water in. It just helps with the pressure. All right, let's take a look and see inside. So like I said, this is a single pistol case and it has a pre-cut foam cutout which is available from Condition 1. Normally the cases come with multiple layers of pluckable foam and I'll show you that. Here's the foam that would come inside this case if you didn't get the custom single pistol insert. Let's just take that guy out and I'll show you. So you've got multiple layers and it's called pluckable foam. And why it's called pluckable foam is because you can pluck these squares out and you see if you bend it, see the spaces in there? It's sort of a die cut foam in there. So if I needed to put, let's say a magnet fishing magnet in it, I could pluck out a bunch of foam here. Uh, if I needed to put, uh, let's say I wanted to put a hammer in there. You know, you can pluck out the foam in the shape of a hammer and then you've got it recessed into your case. So super easy to use and very versatile. So you can put anything you want in these cases. So really cool setup. Now you can also go on their website and you can pick out for many other cases we'll have custom foam inserts like this that are pre-molded, pre-made for a certain application. They make dividers for photography equipment. They make some drone dividers, things like that. And I'm gonna show you a little bit more of that later. So one other thing that really sets this apart from other cases, is it's got this o-ring in it and you can see i can push in on it here so it's got this nice rubber o-ring so hopefully i'm in focus but this lip here is raised and has a separate notch on it so it's got one two levels of notching on it i guess you would say so it goes into this recess and the notch the top notch goes up into here so it has multiple layers of element proofness for lack of a better term when you seal this thing up Keeps the rain out, keeps the dust out. They're lockable. You can put padlocks through this. Uh, a lot of their cases will come with a TSA compliant lock. So if you do need to travel and bring a firearm on an airplane, they've got you covered. This is the condition one case in, in a real small form just to kind of show you the features. Now I'm gonna go and show you all the cases that we use and why we use them. All right, I might as well start out with this one. Sorry if it's not completely in frame, but this is a 16 inch medium carrying case and it's the number 179. And the reason I wanna start out with this one is this is probably my favorite case that they make for a couple of reasons. The size is great. It's something that you can pack up and go for anything. Plus I use it as a handy pistol case. So this particular one you've seen in previous videos and this is all first aid and survival gear. Stays dry dust free clean and that's the 16 inch case number 179 great size and i actually have another one of these right here so they come in bunches of different colors they come in all they've actually got a few new colors out reds yellows greens uh flat dark earth tan od green tons of colors but you'll have to check out the website i'll put a link below for that but this is my other 179 and i'll show you what's neat about this one This one is my range case. So it has one of their custom pre-cut inserts, has room for four pistols, magazines, and accessories. Kept all nice and safe, dustproof, 
waterproof and bash proof. So that's the 179. And like I said, I've got a couple of those. Now let's go downstairs and take a look at some others. All right, next up is the 801. Now this is the one that we specifically got for Alana's photography equipment. And you can take a look inside, spin it around here. It's full of these padded inserts. So instead of having the pluckable foam, this entire padded insert bucket will come out and she can put her camera in, all of her lenses, flash stuff, timers, whatever. She's doing some photo shoots right now, so it's not all in here, but you can get the idea. So she keeps her camera and all of her gear in this and it's super protected in the Condition 1 case. Waterproof, dustproof, and you can see it's got some marks on it and got some dust and dirt on it because we do take it out. Do put it in the back of the truck, put it in the Jeep, take it out on all kinds of adventures. All right, on to the next one. I forgot, I do have a third number 179 from Condition 1, but this one is set up for the kids. So this one has a custom insert. See, this whole piece comes out here. It doesn't have the pluckable foam in it. It has the custom insert for the Nintendo Switch. So you can put the power supply, controllers, games, the whole unit fits in there and keeps it safe. Anybody out there with kids knows they can go over to a friend's house, they can go out, they can do whatever, and they can bash up their stuff. This is a great way to keep it safe. All safe, waterproof, duff proof in the Condition 1 case. All right, let's head out to the garage. All right, so now I'm out in the BCO garage out front. It's about 115 degrees today, so bear with me if I start sweating all over everything. So here is one of the two trunks that we put on the roof rack on the Jeep. As you can see, this is a, a pretty big unit. It has four clasps to keep everything safe. And I think I even have bug smash to the front of it. Show you what this is like and what we use it for. In this one, I keep a layer of gear underneath and then two sleeping bags in each one. That way we can keep full-size sleeping bags. I'm not worried about them getting wet, dusty, or dirty, or anything like that because they are secured in a Condition 1 case on the roof rack. Plus, this gives us a couple inches of room underneath so we can put other gear with it. But yeah, so that is the big yellow trunks. And finally, we've got the big one. This is the 55-inch rifle case, the roller. So reason why it's a roller, it's got wheels on it. So you can roll it around. It's got off-road tire, rubberized tire, so super well built. It has two handles, one on this end so you can walk it and roll it, one right in the middle, four clasps on this one also. Now this one is great because not only is it long, but it's deep. I'll open it up for you. So it's got four clasps. I'll spin it around and open it up. And you can see you can fit all kinds of gear in there. I mean, we've got a recovery strap, we've got two cans of propane, an air mattress, just all kinds of stuff. So all of your odds and ends. So in addition to being long, it's also very deep. When we took a trip up to Colorado last October, this was completely packed with, you know, long john and warm jackets, blankets, things like that. So all that extra stuff that you can't find cubby holes in your vehicle for, you can definitely fit in one of these long cases. Now I also need to mention that Condition One not only makes great hard cases, but they make dry bags, carry gear, and a value line case is called the Rebels. Now this is a Condition 1 Rebel dry bag. I have a couple of these. This one's a backpack, I also have a duffel, and I've actually strapped the duffel onto a trailer and driven it through the mud, and it was just coated in mud, but everything stayed nice and dry inside. Now I'm gonna put links down below to all of these cases in Condition 1, so you can check them out for yourself and pick up some of the, the best gear on earth. Check out those links down below and do me a favor, hit that like and hit that subscribe button. We really appreciate your support. We're gonna continue bringing you great gear reviews, products, adventures, all kinds of neat stuff. So make sure you subscribe and hey, ring that bell over there so you get notifications when we put up a new video. So make sure to check the links down below. So for Bold Canyon Outdoors and Condition One Cases, this is Chris signing off. Happy trails, everybody.